This is Ernest Byron. This is what I see. I mean, we, we got the Joko out here. This is the past which was overruled. It's third and four. You can see the sticks right down here. Third and four. Okay, and one of the things I want you to look at, I want you to be able to understand good receivers, good receivers, even tight ends, they threaten the defenders. Okay, they threaten them. Now, look at his stance. Does that look like a threatening stance? Stance. Does it? I mean, he's standing almost straight up. Now, this is what I want you to also see. How many steps does it take him to get going after the ball is snapped? One, two. He takes almost two steps in place. Look at it again. He replaces his front step, one right there underneath. It takes two, two movements for him to get himself going. Is that threatening the defender? No. Now he has pretty good body lean right there. Pretty good body lean. Okay. Now he raises up to give indicators that he's getting ready to make a move. Look at him. He raises up. Okay, the defender is ready for him to go deep. He's already turned. So if he threatens him more, if he loses that false step, if he loses that false step, then he'll be better able to threaten the defender and also better able to have more separation and more separation would enable him to catch the ball more uninhibited. More so. Okay? More freely. Now he's got guys all over him. So, we'll go back and look at it again. Look at his steps when he comes off the ball. One. Two, it's already in place. He should be gone. That second step needs to be up the field, threatening, gone. Okay, threaten the guy, make him turn, and then plant and roll. Okay, and figure out a way, even with this sucker all over your back, to see if you can make the play. Concerns buying the just what I see.